Welcome to another session of On Common Ground. Today I have with me... Erin Reddershide. From? Long Island, New York. Great. Erin, what year are you in? I am a sophomore. Great. And your major is religious studies, I believe. Yes, it is. And has is that been the motivating factor to get you involved in peer ministry, I believe? Uh, yeah. So I have always wanted to be like a campus minister my whole life and whatnot. Great. Um, and on top of that, I want to be a nurse. So between the two of them, I get to morph them into something called pastoral nursing. So right now I'm getting my religious studies degree here. I'm getting really heavily involved in campus ministry. And then once I graduate from SHU, I'll go and get an accelerated nursing degree. Okay. Yeah, so I'm excited. That's great. Um, and how are you finding the peer ministry and the campus ministry team? Um, what, the, what do you find attractive about it? I love that it's run by the kids. Um, as much as we have faculty and staff in the office, a lot of it is done by the 32 members of the peer ministry team. Um, we're breaking up, we break up into four different pillars and each of these groups like take on certain things. So I'm on the social team. It's very rewarding and I love that there's a lot of things that you can do within peer ministry team that helps the rest of the community. Tell me what else are you involved in? Uh, I am a AMP mentor, which is through the volunteer programs of service learning, um, where I mentor kids in the Bridgeport area at John Winthrop sure. uh, School. So I have three little kids right now. They're in sixth grade. We just went on a field trip this weekend um, to Sturbridge, which is in Massachusetts. Mm -hmm. It's a historical village and we take there and we kind of like try to take them under their wing as much as we are mentoring them with their academics we're there for them just like as someone to look up to um, and I'll follow up with them as I go through my years at SHU I'll go with them at their years at Winthrop so when I graduate here I'll be with them as they graduate from John Winthrop. Oh great now I, if I understand you're going on a service trip to Jamaica. Yes. Kingston, Jamaica yes. in January. We are going with the Mustard Seed Foundation through campus ministry, but it's basically anything that they need. So whether it be like picking up trash or um, staying with people at nursing homes, something to that effect. Um, I'm just, I'm really excited. And how many of you will be going? From the, uh, I think it's 12 of us. I'm all not. from peer ministry? Group? No, it's anybody was able to apply over break um, over the summer. So we have a few people that I know and then people I've never even met. So from the campus. Yeah, from campus. So it should be nice to like interact with different people and not be like the same people that are always in the office sure. type thing. And now how do you find back to what our core here is, <laughs> is, is and why you come is the academics. Um, how do you find them? I think that they're amazing. Um, for me, at least, I have to manipulate my schedule to fit like my nursing prerequisites, my major, and I have two minors, and all of those things that are offered are amazing. Like I can minor in global health, but be a religious studies major. Like I that's think that's great. pretty awesome. That's great. Um, well, I ask everyone this, so. Uh, uh, where on campus is your favorite spot to hang out? Uh, I actually love, there's a hallway in the chapel that like is where like bathrooms are and there's stuff and there's little cubbies with um, like stained glass windows and I plop myself in the middle in there because nobody's there and I'll do homework sometimes in there where like That's nobody's great. able to see me and I could just be there and do my own thing. Well, that's a unique one. Now and then I do get someone that's very <laughs> different in picking spaces which is great. Yeah. So it's, uh, uh, it's great to hear each time that there are other places to hang out. <laughs> yes. Uh, that's wonderful. Hey, that's what the campus life is for. Yeah. And one of my last questions really is, uh, if you had to summarize, uh, which you don't have to, but I'm asking yeah. you to, uh, summarize your shoe experience in one word, what would you say? Home. Um, I live from Long Island, so I'm really close to home. Uh, but there's something about this place that I knew that I had to be here and that it's somewhere that I want to spend my time. Yeah. That's great. Well, good luck. Thank and you. And have a safe and very productive <laughs> trip in Kingston. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you, Erin. Good luck. No problem.